to just... being normal. Hey everybody, subscribe, please. Please subscribe. Now enjoy this video, but subscribe, not... subscribe first. We never sound unhinged. No, I'm, I'm more hinged than I've ever been in my entire life. All right. Hi everybody. Hi everybody. Welcome to the Kitchen and Jorn Show. I'm Kitchen. And I'm Jorn. And, and I had a meltdown about my outfit this morning, but we fixed it. We're filming this on uh, International Indigenous People's Day. So I was like, I have to wear my biggest earrings that I feel like wearing. Those are really pretty. They're huge. This we is fixed, a really cute outfit We too. fixed it. I know, but I was wearing a different skirt and then I got a sandwich on it and I put on a different skirt and I had to change it because it was ugly. And then I put on a different skirt and changed it because it didn't match. And then I found the court, it doesn't matter. Today in the Kitchen Jordan Show, the role of Jordan will be played by Jordan, and the role of Kitchen will be played by Kitchen, and the role of food will be played by every Aldi's coffee. The coffee brand at Aldi's is Barissimo Coffee. That's their in-house brand. <laughs> Barissimo. It's like barista, but bellissimo. Yeah, wait, that is what it is. It's the English language. Such a beautiful invention. Of the all these coffees, I think there's like 15, 17 ish. There's several cold coffees, and then we have beans for hot coffees. As per usual, when we rate the food, we rate it on a scale of just okay, pretty good, really great. And if you absolutely suck, your penalty box bad. And if Kristen and I disagree, and then you go in the fight box. The fight box is really an experiment to see what happens when people stop being fake and start getting real. Seven coffees go in a box. What happens is eventually they will either accuse each other of racism or they will fall in love. Maybe both, I don't really know. And that's what happens um, in this season of The Fight Box. You're gonna love it. I have already had some coffee today. What, I can't tell. Yeah, I'm a little caffeinated, yeah. but I'm about to be more caffeinated. The first Aldi's coffee we are gonna be trying is the Barissimo brand Caramel Macchiato Iced Coffee. This should be interesting because I definitely will experience the descent into madness as I drink more caffeine, so fun for everyone. If you've seen our video where we tried all the Trader Joe's coffees, it got unhinged by the end. It got unhinged? Unhinged. You gotta pull out Bree's fancy coffee grinder. We need to make noise for no reason. Oh, is that all the ones we gotta grind? Yeah. You wanna take the one that's about to fall? Oh, yes, we're trying this one first. Barissimo! Right. That's what I say when you think your barista's hot. Oh, you're supposed to enjoy the rice. Whatever. Oh, this is pretty good. This is basically dessert. I mean, like, let's be real. Like, these are dessert. This is dessert beverage. I don't really taste caramel. It mostly just tastes like very sugary iced coffee, but it's tasty. I think it's pretty good. I think it's pretty good. So this is the next coffee we are trying. This is the Barissimo Mocha Iced Coffee. This, this be, looks like chocolate milk. It's gonna be chocolate milk with consequences. Yeah. And the consequences are we both become there's coffee on the floor. That's, How did you I do mean, that? I mean, because I, you said consequences and I said, I'll create some. This is like the last one, but sweeter. It's like more, slightly more chocolatey. It's chocolate sweeter, but I think it has less flavor. It tastes a little protein powdery. It tastes a little like a Nesquik. That's uh, what it is, yes. It tastes yes. a little uh, Nesquik 3 a.m., but I mixed it in water because I didn't want to open the fridge to get the milk out. This is just okay. The next thing we're trying is the Verissimo French Vanilla Ice Latte. I think this is going to taste the same as everything else we've tried. Yeah, I've, I think it I looks think, exactly I the same. we're trying a lot of like just sugar bombs. This tastes like the milk you drink after you've eaten the cereal. 43 grams of sugar. It's a lot of sugar. <laughs> The French vanilla ice latte, just okay. If there was a category below just okay and above penalty box bad, where like I swallowed it, but like I regret it. College. We've all been there, girl. Can we create girl. like a category for like regretful swallows? So next we're trying the cafe latte, ice latte, ice ice latte, coffee, safi, laugh, ice bellissimo. This one has more sugar. How does it? Cheers. Cheers. This is better. Is it? It's better, it's less sweet. The problem with a lot of their iced coffees is that they're very sweet and you don't get much flavor. So they all sort of end up tasting the same. Okay, it is slightly better, but it's so sweet. Still just okay. I'm comfortable saying just okay. <sighs> we have moved on to trying- The coffees that are real. This is the Barissimo Hazelnut Hot Coffee. Look at this squirrel. Does he like coffee? I don't know, let's ask him. Ooh. Not bad. You smell the hazelnut a lot more than you taste it, in yes. my opinion. Yes. However, it's not very bitter. It's kind of, it's very smooth, which is it's nice. Not bad. Could it be better? Sure. I think it could have a stronger flavor for sure. I wish that it tasted as hazelnutty as it smells. I wish it was a category between just okay and pretty good. Yeah. League's better than any of the iced ones we've tried. Yeah, that makes sense. All right, the hazelnut hot coffee, pretty good. Next, we've got the Guatemala. Guatemala? What? <laughs> The Guatemala medium roast ground coffee, it's smooth and exotic. Ooh, fruity. The previous coffee was a light coffee. This is a medium roast, and you can taste that it is a medium this roast. This is better. It's no, got a it's worse. No, it's the same. I don't really know. It's more bitter, but it's more fruity, like an old queen. Fuller bodied, fruity, and a little bitter. It's me in like 15 years. I think it's just okay. Really? 
Do you, do you think it's pretty good? I think it's pretty good. Because oh. usually darker, darker roasts, I tend to find too bitter. So I actually am surprised that this medium roast is hitting okay for me. Uh, yeah. I think it's pretty good. I'll say it's pretty good. We're making these coffees with a pour over as we try them. It's taking a minute. Oh, Kristen, so will you vamp while I get the coffee going? No vamp with words. Oh. First time I ever tried coffee, I was 13 years old, and that was too young. Listen, I'm not gonna lie to you, I don't really like coffee. I think it's fine. I don't find like divine satisfaction in it the way some people do. Some people are just like coffee, I love it. The, don't talk to me until I've had a cup of my coffee. And you know, for me, I'm kind of just like, just don't talk to me at all, you know? This is going really well. <laughs> Coffee, coffee, hey! This next coffee we're trying is the breakfast blend. It's a medium roast. And it's got a chicken. This is a rooster. Oh, it's got a co- I hate this. this Why? This is not good. What's wrong with this one? It tastes two pennies. It's pennies. There's like a copper There's taste? There's a coppery taste to it. Okay. Two pennies, too furious. I'm gonna defer to you on this one. I think it's just okay. Let's fight box it. It doesn't really have much going on. It is like a medium blend, but it's reminiscent of the Guatemalan coffee I for me. I do not think so at all. Guatemalan was so much better. And maybe the parrot had something to do with that, but I doubt it, okay? Maybe it's just a superior bird. Oh. Do, 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 this do, is really do. hot. Do, okay. do, do. Oh my God. Oopsie. Do, 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 do. So this is the house blend medium roast from Aldi. It's a delightfully mild and balanced blend. It displays notes of rich chocolate, sweet molasses, and nuances of tobacco. This is an old leather grandpa. I think there's a nuttiness. I do think there's some sweetness to it. I think this is actually decent. This, this is pretty, pretty good. good. This is pretty good. It's not bitter at all for a medium roast, which is cool. Yes. So this is the French vanilla, and boy, is it stinky of vanilla. It smells like candy. It does. The French like vanilla it. flavor mixes actually pretty decently with the strongness of the coffee. It's kind of like a nice comforting hug in your mouth. This is a nice light coffee. This is actually the coffee I like the best. Mostly because you can taste the flavor that it's mixed with. It's not just like, here's a flavor, but it's mostly a suggestion. This one actually takes a suggestion. I'm comfortable with giving this really great. This is really great. Well, okay, for all these coffee. This is the Midnight Blends. This is a very dark roast. Dark cocoa, toasted nuts, and tobacco. Oh, I completely zoned out and forgot to try. I feel like I just ate dirt. This is a pretty dirt forward <laughs> coffee. <laughs> Essence of mud. It's it's uh it's got a very heavy, heavy, muddy flavor. Yeah, it tastes like dirt. <laughs> I think this is just okay. I it's, soil. It's so <laughs> Cirque de Soyel. <laughs> this coffee is caffeinated and that's nice. The bottom of the shoe. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay, it's bad. Yep. Just okay. I think it's penalty box bad. Well, I it No. <laughs> It's just okay. No, we'll fight box it. This is Sumatra dark roast ground coffee. There's a tiger on the cover. Oh, this is dark coffee, so it's probably gonna taste like Oh, it's pretty good. That does have hints of spice in it. It's tasty. Yeah, I mean, for what it is, obviously this is Aldi's ground coffee with a tiger on the cover. It's not gonna be like, mm, num, 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 num. It's not super bitter. Like it's a smooth drink. It goes down easy, which is nice. I would say this is pretty good. This is pretty good. The dark roasts have been a lot better than I expected. I mean, I think we were also rating these a little higher than we were like probably 20 minutes ago because we were like juiced on caffeine. I mean, yeah, now I feel really energized. Now we're just like, should we shoot like eight videos today? Should we get like our medical degrees today? I could pass the bar right now and that I could drive by a bar in my car. <laughs> <gasps> Why? Here's the good news. Most of it is on my shirt. Uh-huh. There's no coffee in there. <laughs> this is the Barissimo Colombia blend. Uh, this one, ooh. This one Worse. has a really metallic aftertaste. This I don't is like, like it. The turtle will let me down. It's kind of sour. It's more like Barissimo, yeah. no. Yeah, Barissimo, no, 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 no. This is just okay. This is aggressively just okay. Yeah. This is our final coffee of the video. And this coffee is the Donut Store Blend Medium Roast. It's their Dunkin' Donuts. When everyone's do. like Donut Store, it means like the Dunkin' Donuts dupe. Yeah. The Dunkin' Dupe Nuts. It's really it's flavorless. Just absolutely flavorless. This is that a lighter is, roast. Uh, yeah. It's a, okay, so it's, it's a lighter roast, but unlike the other roast, this one has no flavor. It's hot, sassy water. Yeah, it's queer eye water. It's hydration, but not. Yeah, well, it is a diuretic, so you're gonna shit yourself. <laughs> this is kind of box bad. It's it just tastes like bad. nothing. It doesn't even taste like donuts. Aldi, your coffee. It's all right. Some it's of fine. them are decent. I like tiger and I like vanilla. I think about Aldi coffee is it's that, that it's, it's fine. You know, do you need coffee? Like really need coffee? It doesn't matter where it came from. It came from Aldi. This was fun.
We release new videos every Friday. Every Friday. At 12 p.m. Pacific Whether time. Whether you like it or not. And some of you don't. Some of you don't. That's why you get blocked. We love you. Please subscribe. And we're normal. And have a good time. I know. And only nor normal. Bye. Bye. Okay. <laughs> that was really good.